Kay from Crafting with Kay. How are you doing? So this is just a little short video showing off what I got from uh, Teresa's Needle and Cover Minders. She's got a little group which will be linked down below. Now this one's already out of the fact because I got this one a few days ago but I wanted to show it off. It's a cute little bumblebee with of course very strong magnet. But I got like how cute is that little guy? So let's get into this bag. So how are we all doing? Mm -hmm. Hope we're doing well. Father of Pickle says hey. Right, so let's tip this out. Right. There we go, pop that to the side. Oh, very nice. Bubble wrap and some velvet bags, nice. Very nicely done. Uh, so there's some magnets. Let's see what we've got in here. Oh, aren't these beautiful? Got some honeycomb. I saw this one. I liked it, so go with the bee. How cool is that? We've got a yin and yang. Kind of goes with the tattoo I have. We've got this moon. I didn't realise it had a star in it when I ordered it. That's quite cool. And this little kitty. Oh, it's got a little gem in it as well. So these are some cover slash needle minders. I'm thinking in here is, she's asked me to, oh yeah, I forgot about this one. So I also ordered this one because of just how sparkly and blingy is that. That's just brilliant. We've got Crazy Sewing Lady. That's definitely more of a cover. I mean, like, it will hold a needle. Uh, here's one. Oh, yeah, it might help if I put the magnet on the bottom. Let's just nick the bumblebees one a minute. She says. No. Maybe it's because it's a different magnet. But yeah, the dome ones aren't as good. Like, we'll hold a needle, but they're not as good as, say, the flatter ones. So I personally use the more domed as uh, cover minders. And the flatter ones as needle minders. If you'd like a video on the difference between the two of you know how they work and all that let me know down below and i will happily show you that's just oh yeah that will work nice i like that it's so blingy i love it let's just pop that back on there right now this one she's asked me to um test for her it's basically inside a bottle cap that's good the edges aren't sharp or anything so i like that so in theory, again, we should be able to, Ooh, which way is it going? Ah, magnets are strong. So let's just see how, Oops. see it works as a needle minder. So that means it would definitely work as a cover minder. I would say more cover minder because where the, um, it's slightly domed. I find the needle doesn't always hold on as strongly as it would typically do. Hang on a minute, let me just, I flip the magnet round. Well, this does work as a needle minder. I said, I was a bit nervous when she said she was doing these because I thought the caps might be a bit sharp, but they're actually, you won't cut yourself on that. It's a nice way to recycle as well, actually. So this is what I've got. Let's attach magnets. So this should be fun. Again, I'm loving the velvet bags. So, and I've got a bit of cardboard here. So let's line these bad boys up. And then we can see them in order glory. Oh, damn, these are strong. <laughs> So 
sorry about that, took a bit of finagling. So here we have all of my little magnets. Sweet, and then they all hold on with the magnets. But yeah, I definitely recommend giving her shop a little try. Again, I love how blingy that is. But yeah, I love the effects, if you can see in certain lights, it changes the uh, shade of blue. And yeah, so yeah, let me know what you think down below. I definitely rate, would uh, recommend giving them a try. Hello, sweetie. So until next time, say take care, say bye. You're going to put your hand in. Bye, guys. Bye. Bye. <laughs>